Hi, welcome back to the LCP Digital Learning Channel. Today I'm going to show you a quick tip on that will help you in the classroom as a teacher, but it will also greatly help your students while they're working. Okay, first thing I want to talk about is on your iPad at the bottom you'll see a dock. Now the ones to the left of the line, those are icons that I have chosen to be there. So for example, this post-it one, I can take out or I can long, long press and put it into my dock. Okay, those are the ones that I might use all the time. Okay, number two, the ones to the right of that line, those three that you see, keynote numbers and notes, those are ones that I've just used. Okay, so it's really important that I either have the icons that I want to dual screen at the bottom or have just used recently. So I'm gonna make sure I'm gonna open up Keynote and I'm also gonna make sure I've just opened up um, Chrome. All right, so let's get started. Inside of Keynote, I have a blank document, and say, for example, the kid is researching or you're building a Keynote and you're wanting to bring photos in. So normally you'd have to go to Chrome, find the photos, download them into the um, camera roll, bring them in from the camera roll. I'm gonna show you a really quick tip. So the first thing you're gonna do is you're going to slow swipe just a little from the bottom of your screen and it brings up the toolbar. So let's show that again. Slow swipe from the bottom brings up the toolbar. Okay, now I'm going to want to dual screen with Chrome. So I'm going to touch Chrome and I'm going to bring it over to the corner of the iPad. So now I have a dual screen. The little bar in the middle allows me to touch and drag to make it either a full split or maybe I want one bigger than the other. Okay, so I'm going to go straight up 50-50. And maybe the student is researching airplanes. So I'm gonna come right here and I'm gonna type in airplane. Search. Now I'm gonna to go to images. And so maybe this is one of the images I want. And so all I do is touch the image and then drag it over to Keynote. And just like that, here's that one. Then I'm gonna do a new slide. Maybe I want this picture. So touch, drag it over. Now I have that one. So this is gonna be really helpful for kids bringing in pictures from Chrome, but if you're working on your iPad, maybe you could have your report cards up on one side and maybe some things that you're grading on the other side. Or you know, um, if you're working in a Word document and you wanna be typing while the other side is what you're researching um, on one of your sources. So super great way to um, multi-screen, and all I gotta do is just take that black line and I'm just gonna drag it to the side of the screen and so now I'm in just in the single view. Hope that was helpful. If you found this video helpful, make sure and hit that like button. To make sure you get more videos like this, be sure to click right here to subscribe and to click the bell to make sure you get notifications. If you'd like to submit a topic or concept for future videos, there's a link in the description down below. And if you're looking for more digital learning tips and tricks, make sure to follow us on Twitter.